What's up you guys? It's Bucky Girl 7 here and we're at Hardin Park today. We brought my new bike that my husband got me. He's riding it right now. It's a pink bike, but you know what? He's man enough to do it. But as soon as we pulled in here, I found a wild tentacruel, which I have not seen in a very long time. Um, I used to catch these a lot back when the game first came out. But um, ever since Gen 2 and Gen 3 have dropped, I haven't seen as many of uh, the Gen 1 rare Pokemon like that. And it ran away! No! No, God! Oh my God, that was bad luck as soon as we got here. Wow, I did not expect that at all. It ran away in one ball. But yeah, we're at Hardin Park. Um, it's actually a pretty decent place to play. There's four Pokestops here and one gym, so it's actually decent. I cannot believe that Tentacurl uh, ran, though. That is absolutely insane. But yeah, I'm excited to come play here today. And I just got a 10K egg and an upgrade from that Pokestop. Wow, this is super lit already crazy day already but yeah this might be my new place that I come to do live streams and vlogs and things like that so let me know in the comments down below if you think this this would be a cool place to uh, play every day so yeah let's get the adventure started for the day so he bought the bike for me but he totally just like ran away He's absolutely insane. He loves that bike way more than me. <laughs> I haven't even really had a chance to uh, ride it much yet. Wow, we are so out of storage. I'm gonna have to transfer my baby Cleffa. Oh well. Look, there he is. We busted. You left me. <laughs> We're gonna shiny check this Aeron right here and not a shiny. But wow, I really love this park. It's a beautiful place to be. He likes that bike more than me, don't you? <laughs> it's, was it hard? <laughs> He's gonna test and see how fast it goes. I haven't even rode it yet. I think I'm gonna ride it after I get done with this Aeron here. And we caught it. I really need to start doing some more Aeron evolutions. Look how many candies I have. 2632. I need to start evolving some more Aerons. I actually have a 100% I haven't even evolved yet. So maybe we'll do that in today's video. Not for sure. Let's see what we got in the nearby here. Wow, we got a Carvana, a Suda Wudo, and a few shining opportunities there. So pretty decent. But we kind of need to head back in the other direction to get to the Pokestops. But I think I'm going to ride my bike for a bit and then we'll go get some stuff over on that side of the park. to get an AR plus shot of that barbo from the water and it ran away <laughs> but I couldn't get close enough because uh, I was scared I would fall into the water and there's ducks fighting over there they were like fighting to the death and I, I was afraid they were gonna attack me or something so um, but this is like a single focus stop at this park but it had some pretty good water spawns they actually uh, aren't showing up at the moment there was like a barbo to star you uh, toad it all so this is actually a really good water biome to be in and it's so beautiful out here I know I keep saying that but it really is and there we have it the star you I haven't caught um, many water Pokemon in a very long time this is like the first water biome I've been to in a while there's one downtown that I haven't really been going to lately um, but this might be a good place to find some Phoebus and Magikarp potentially so I actually did see a Magikarp on my way in and I thought it was a shiny because uh, I was playing on my iPhone instead of my Android for once and like it, the screen is way more vibrant so um, for some reason the color just looked different and I thought I had a shiny so I kind of had like a mini heart attack but no shiny Magikarp for me today 
But speaking of that, um, there's actually partly cloudy weather in the game right now. So um, Aerons are going to be spawning a little bit more often. So we might actually have a chance of getting one of those today. And my husband's still riding my bike. <laughs> it's actually a really nice bike. He got it for me like as a late Valentine's Day present. And I'm really enjoying it. It's really fun. Only $3.99, <laughs> as Cutie Pie would say. I want to figure out where that Carvana is over there. Oh, dang. We need to go to the other side of the park, babe. You want to ride over there? But can you do this? Yes, I think all bikes can do that, unfortunately. <laughs> made it over here to the little uh, quadruple Pokestop and one thing I wanted to talk about that I just now thought of um, the Lunar Year event is over the Lunar New Year event my apologies um, I did not get the shiny Puccina um, I did grind pretty hard it was just such a short event I didn't really like have much time to get it um, anybody that did get a shiny Puccina congratulations I seen that Pokey AK got like three shinies in one hour which is absolutely insane um, I was grinding hard like the last two hours of the event and I was super depressed to not uh, get the shiny but um, shiny Puchiana is still available. You can still catch it, it's just going to be a little bit harder to come by so try to find a Puchiana nest, nest on the Silk Road uh, Nest Atlas and eventually you might be able to track one down. But yeah, we're having a good time at the park. Are you having fun? Yeah. <laughs> it's beautiful here and uh, my hubby here has been a very good videographer. He's been taking awesome videos. And uh, it's been a really good day so far. It's really beautiful out here. But yeah, um, pretty much we're just gonna chill for the rest of the day. I guess hang out here for a while. Do you wanna do that? Whatever you wanna do. Yeah, I like the sound of that. <laughs> happy wife, happy life, right? Yeah. <laughs> so this month's community day is going to be February 24th. That's this coming Saturday. Um, we're gonna have increased Tertini spawns for three hours. It's gonna be from 2 p.m. Eastern time to 5 p.m. Eastern time. And they also announced that any Dragonite that you evolve during this event is going to have the move Draco Meteor, which is one of the strongest moves in the main series game. So I'm super excited that we're finally going to see that in Pokemon Go. It's really cool that it's going to be exclusive. So it's going to be awesome. Definitely go out and play. Um, during those three hours, they're going to have um, the three times amount of Stardust for every Pokemon that you catch. So go out there on Community Day. And it's actually been rumored that there's going to be a Shiny Dratini, which I am definitely hoping for. I think that's what they're going to do. They've been dropping a lot of shinies lately and it's kind of like the pattern that they've been going by. So if we get shiny Dratini, I'm going to be super stoked to finally have a pink shiny in the game. It's going to be lit. So mark your calendars, February 24th, be there or be square. I'm the queen of the world. Right. Yay, I'm like two feet off the ground. <laughs> Um, so my bike broke. <laughs> I don't know what to do. It's like, what happened? Oh, man. <laughs> what happened? I didn't even do it, he did it. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> So while I'm waiting for him to fix my bike, 
<laughs> I'm gonna do this uh, Anarith evolution. Uh, this is gonna be a Pokedex entry Armaldo. I've been waiting a long time to do this one. This this thing uh, spawns a little bit with the partly cloudy weather, but he's been really hard to come by. Um, I have pineapped everyone that I've caught, so um, it did take me a hot minute, but I got it. So here we have it, Armaldo. That is a sick looking Pokemon. He's one of the fossil types of Gen 3. He kind of has like the same statistics as Kabutops and uh, he actually has the same like spawn rate as Kabutops in Pokemon Go, so it's actually interesting. So let's see the IVs on this. I think they were pretty good. Uh, Simply Maces Me, Attack, Defense, and Blown Away Bot Stats. So that's almost a 100% Armaldo. And it has Fury Cutter and Rock Blast. I don't know the best moveset for this thing. Um, it's a pretty decent attacker, actually. A lot of people don't really talk about this one, but um, he would actually get the job done in battle against the rock type, so uh, it's actually a decent Pokemon. So yeah, drop a like for the Ar Armaldo uh, evolution there. So we're basically just walking around the park, riding the bike a little bit. This isn't much of a Pokemon Go vlog. Here he goes. Yay! <laughs> it's more of just a normal vlog, honestly. Uh, we're just wanting to have a good time for the weekend. This is his last day off work before he has to go back to work for a whole week. And his birthday is actually on Friday, so we're wanting to spend some time together. Here he comes back, y'all. <laughs> but um, I actually caught a weather boosted for a closet this morning, but I'm gonna make that a part of tomorrow's video. So you're gonna see it like, I'm gonna be kind of going back in time a little bit. But definitely stay tuned for tomorrow's video because it's gonna be really cool. Um, it was actually a really good catch and I'm pretty stoked about it. So yeah, definitely check it out. Um, are you wore it out? <laughs> so now we're back shopping because uh, for hubby's birthday, we're probably gonna get him a box so we can go riding bikes together from now on because we really enjoyed it today and we think we're gonna have a good time uh, doing it together instead of taking turns on my little pink bike. <laughs> Dude, he wants that. What is that? <laughs> that's awesome. It's like a miniature go kart. Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. Is it really? Yeah. Holy crap, that's expensive. Let's try to find some Pokemon since we're in the toy section. <laughs> I just found a slack off in Walmart. Every time we come to Walmart, I find really super rare spawns, so that's lit. We got normal spawns spawning more right now because of partly cloudy weather, so that's dope. So I guess that's it for today's video. It was a little bit more vlog than usual, but we had a really good day. Um, my husband's actually gonna go outside and shoot his crossbow he just got last weekend at Knifeworks. If you guys didn't see my Pigeon Forge Tennessee vlog, go check it out. It's on my recent uploads. But anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. Become a part of my Gengar gang, and I will see y'all in the next one.